All right, we have a lot to talk for this video. The first thing is I've placed all my guppies in my brackish aquarium. I've removed pumpkin spice as well as all the other fish that you don't see. And the reason is because ta -da, we have a figure eight puffer fish, finally. Uh, this animal I've been wanting uh, since the beginning of the brackish aquarium project. Uh, I've always wanted a big puffer fish. I didn't have a lot of luck with pea puffers because they were just very aggressive, but this dude is much bigger, <clears throat> much more interesting, and uh, also have more personality. And uh, one amazing thing about him is the fact that he will eat all my snails. I actually got more snails for him uh, in this aquarium, but yeah. He is very cool. Now since it is a brackish fish, you cannot keep them in freshwater nor saltwater aquarium. You have to go right in the middle. That's where they like to live. Um, and they don't grow to be super massive. Like maybe he's going to grow a bit bigger than this, but like 3-4 inch is pretty much his final size. So that is very interesting. Um, and yeah, he's pretty cool, pretty curious, uh, he don't hide a lot, he actually likes to explore the entire tank. I'm going to uh, rebuild it a bit so it's more interesting for both him and my uh, knight Gobi. He doesn't seem to mind uh, with the platies and stuff and I just really want to make sure to keep an eye on my friend right here because he's kind of a bit aggressive. Uh, with his territory, but you know, I think both of them are going to be fine. Uh, I've seen no sign of aggression so far, and um, yeah, he's very interesting. I've never seen such a cool fish, and it's very smart. Like you can tell, just by the way it's looking at everything, uh, you can tell that it is a very inquisitive hunter. But luckily for us, He's only interested in snails, so that's cool. And uh, I just really love his coloration. Also, the reason why um, I like him is also because he actually will accept pellet food. Uh, obviously, snails is going to be his main source of food, but it is uh, a good news that he also accepts other type of um, food for his diet. Uh, did this really help me simplify uh, the care for him and yeah just look at him he needs a new name and I need your help because uh, such a fish with such a personality cannot be unnamed for very long right um, and yeah I just really love all the little spot in him and all the nice coloration there is still two uh, at Lani Chez Moi, where I got him, uh, but I think they were reserved already, but yeah, <laughs> I'm pretty lucky to have him, and that's what I like to do uh, with my local fish store, you know, do some deals and stuff, and I have some fish that not a lot of other people have, so that is definitely something special. Um, I also did a lot of other change in other aquarium. So for example, in my quarantine tank, I have new fish in quarantine. Uh, so more like dwarf neon rainbow fish. I just forgot I uh, actually like, uh, like you know, they, the local fish store got them for me, but I forgot it about it for like two weeks. And yeah, I'm still uh, fighting ick in this aquarium. That's why some of the fish are a bit lethargic, but uh, ick seems to be vanishing slowly but surely so that's a good news uh, and these fish they are going to go in my bigger aquarium uh, I just want them to grow out a little bit more uh, so my angel fish don't eat them but yeah um, I've put all my other rainbow fish in the bigger aquarium just because they are getting too big for the brackish aquarium and that means I'm going to remove some of my other fish but when I say remove them I don't mean sell them I have actually two more aquariums, but not in the same fish room. Uh, and this is where pumpkin spice 
bunny as well as other fish that you might not know yet are right now so yeah uh, I'm going to sell no sorry I'm going to put these fish in that aquarium and that's another subject for another time so yeah sorry there was a lot of process in this video um, it's kind of a uh, updated of week type of video uh, so I'm going to put it in the playlist uh, but yeah I have two more aquarium guys and they are finally ready um, to be shown I wanted to make sure they were perfect just before I presented them to you but now I think we've reached this uh, point since January I've been working like a little bee and yeah finally all my efforts are coming to a conclusion uh, so let me know what you think make sure to subscribe to both this channel and Bob Army Comedic Squad if you're not already because I have new stuff uh, coming pretty soon for both this uh, channel and the other one uh, go also on my Facebook group Oranda Power if you want to um, you know just share your aquarium and, st and stuff with me and make sure to comment like subscribe and do everything you want let me know a special name for the peepoffer as well. Ciao!